Hey besties, welcome back to my channel, welcome back for a brand new video. I thought we could go on a little solo shopping trip today. I'm going to my bear next week, so I want to see if I can get any last minute bits. I'm going to go Zara, Primark, H&M. No idea what to expect, it is a Friday afternoon, so I actually don't know if the shops are going to be good or not. But just thought I'd go have a look. I am going out tomorrow as well, and I don't have an outfit really that I want to wear. We're doing like a bottomless brunch in London, like during the day and stuff. Fucking how I'm sweating in this car. I'm going to try and like see if I can find an outfit for tomorrow as well. So I've seen Zara. I have got like loads of new perfumes in that are meant to be like Jutes of Sol de Janeiro. I just don't know what I'm going to be able to get because realistically, Cambridge shopping is fucking shit. So I'm hoping that it pulls through. I'm going to drive to the shops now and then I'll catch you when I'm there. We arrived in Cambridge. The car park looks insanely busy. Like I'm literally on level five and there's six levels to the car park. To be fair, there probably was, there obviously was spaces down below, but I I just like to park i like to have the car park to myself do you know what i mean like i like to park with no one next to me either side i'm just in mango i really love these sandals oh my god this dress is actually stunning looks like it would fit so nice i really love the big like sleeves on it look how nice all of these like summer bags are they're actually gorgeous i love this and all of these ones as well i mean mango bags are the best look at these earrings this is also stunning this is giving marbella holiday vibes and this one as well i of course just had to come in to find tiger and look at these little cherry mugs can't pick it up but how cute are they I really love all these like little flower bowls as well just in zara and i actually ordered this bag online but i didn't realize how small it was but it is so cute i thought it's more perfect for holiday i think it's currently really giving like there's cute bits but you know when it's just like be fair though this isn't like the best song upstairs is way better oh my god they now do the leopard print bodysuit how sick is this stop i think these little shorts are sick like how much of a vibe are they oh i really love these i might have to like try them on how nice of an outfit would this shirt be with the little black leopard print shorts. I'm just in the Zara change room to try all this on. I really love these shorts, so I really hope they look cute. And then I've got this behind. I'm not really too sure what vibe I was going for. I just kind of picked up stuff that I like, but I don't really know if it's very Marbella or <laughs> like anything. I just picked up stuff that I like. Skirt fits good, but I just don't know whether I like like it on me. I don't know whether I like the puffy bit, but considering this is like Zara denim, it actually fits really well. Vision for this is not visioning. To be fair, these would be really cute on holiday. I'm just not sure if I like this whole vibe, but I do really love these shorts. I love this top and I love the shorts, but definitely just like not together. I do think the top fits really, really nice. I don't know what I would wear it with because it's quite like a long line top. These shorts are Stunning. I just went into H&M but the queue was so big to pair because I saw this really cute little vest and they did have some nice summer stuff in but you know and it's not like I want to buy you kind of vibe. I'm just walking over to Primark. I did get some bits from Zara so I can't wait to do a haul. I've seen that Primark have these like new cherry pyjamas and I want them so bad so I hope they have them although three o'clock on a Friday is not giving that they're gonna have them. Okay, I've made it to Primark. Please, please, please have some good stuff. I'm straight to the pajamas, see if they have them, but they definitely don't. Do you know what? I kinda knew they wasn't anyway, but look how cute these are. Little flowery shorts and tops. I might get some of these. These are like my favorite sandals ever. They're so comfortable. They look bougie, so I've just picked up a yellow pair. But these look really nice as well with the crochet. I'm gonna get some of these if they have my size. Do they, do they, do they? yay looks so nice little denim skirt is so cute i wasn't planning on buying a lot but obviously i've ended up with a basket i might have a leopard print maxi and even has a really cute little lace trim at the top i love this i just don't know if i'd get enough wear out of it bomber jacket looks actually stunning i really want to get it but i just don't need it oh my god imagine i've just got back to the car completely forgot to take my parking ticket with me so i've just walked up five flights of stairs and i've got to go back down and come back up i always do that like i always forget but i had to get myself a costume i got myself the whipped white chocolate whip latte again. I'm literally sweating. I'm going to have to take this blazer off. This is just so good. Anyway, I'm going to do a haul of what I got when I get home just because it's easier than doing it in the car. But I literally just got the most random stuff. I'm sorry, I'm going to have to take this off. If anything, I'm not going to lie. I feel like I just spent money today for no reason. Like, I did get some cute bits. But you know when it's like, when I'm like sitting here now, I'm like, did I really fucking need that? No. It's haul time. I thought I'd show you everything I got and then we could also try everything on as well. I'm not going to lie. I feel like I didn't actually go as overboard as I usually do when I go shopping today. I was really trying to refrain myself. I wanted to go back to H&M to get this like top, but the queue was so big and I was like, you know when you're shopping and then you're like, I just need to get home. But we will first start off with Zara. Honestly, I'm actually so glad that like, I go and actually try things on in Zara because a lot of the time when I try things on, I'm like, 
Mm. I actually don't love stuff as much as I thought I was gonna. I picked up this little cropped kind of blazer moment. This is just very me. A beige blazer. I was like, I bought this and then I sat in the car because I was like, I really, really love this. I think this is sick. I think it'd be such a good like jeans and a nice top vibe, especially in summer or like with some denim shorts on holiday in England. Like it is the perfect like staple wardrobe piece. But realistically, all I wear when I go out is literally a crop top, blue jeans and blazers. And then also you saw me when I tried these on. I just think these little denim shorts are sick. I just love the vibe. I think they're a lot more like comfier than like normal denim shorts. They're a lot more chill vibes, but I do think you could like really dress these up. Like I feel like these shorts with the blazer can actually be such a cute outfit. No, stop. I really, really love that. Funny, Zara bought out loads of dupe perfumes recently. I've seen it all over my TikTok. I've definitely saved TikToks, but I literally couldn't remember what they were. And they didn't have the Soldier Janeiro dupe in there. I didn't think they were going to be fair. But I smelled this one. And good tip is to spray perfume. Go into Zara. Spray like a couple perfumes on you that you think you might like. Walk around the store. Do your shopping. And then you can like smell the perfume on you. Because sometimes we're not need to let the perfume sit so i ended up picking this one it's called moonlight whisper and you all know i don't think you can see that but you all know how much i love pistachio this has got pistachio cardamom and pink sugar in and she's gorgeous she is stunning it needs right now and also look how big and bougie like this bottle looks it's literally huge it isn't usually like a scent i go for but it just smells so good especially when it like sits on the skin for a bit and then primark time i actually didn't get that much from primark i think it's because i went to primark last week and got like quite a few bits Plus, of course i had to get some pajamas i just thought these were so cute they've got little flowers on little frills these are actually giving me like Brandy Melville vibes because I have some similar to this from Brandy Melville. I, I was literally buzzing when I saw these and they also do these in blue as well but I'm a pinky, pinky girl. I've got these Primark sandals which if you don't know about these Primark sandals, get to know because I had these last year in white. I wore them to O Beach. I wore them literally all summer. Don't give you blisters. So comfortable. I've got them in gold now and then I really wanted just like a nice kind of classic-y brown pair which I know will pretty much go with all my outfits. I did have the yellow ones in my hand originally and I was like you know what I'm just going to get a pair which I know I'm going to get like a lot more wear out of. I also saw these now I'm hoping these are going to be comfy as well but they're like a crochet style they're in the same style as the other ones but like crochet. I just thought these were giving bougie expensive they were giving Marbella. Then I literally can't go to Primark without getting some phone charms so I picked up this one for Karis. I'm hoping it's gonna focus please it's got like a little disco ball it's got a little disco ball here i really love this one but it's just a bit bit too much for my phone so i just picked up this one which i thought was so cute it has like little flowers on how adorable is that i also just picked up some more of these tops for my mum because she got them last week and she really loves them they're the ones with like the bra pad on the inside and she wore she got it in green and she was wearing it so much last week they look so nice they're eight pounds of a built-in bra and honestly they're such a nice fit i'd really recommend i just realistically don't need any more of these little tops i'm gonna try on my little zara outfit I'm lying i was not expecting this outfit to slay like this is one of my favorite outfits i've even worn recently you know when you buy something and you're just like mm, could be cute could not be cute excuse the mess in the background but how stunning is this whole vibe i am fully obsessed i'm so gutted because tomorrow it's meant to be like cloudy like 21 degrees so it's still hot but it's also meant to rain tomorrow whereas sunday it's 23 degrees so i really can't wear this for like my bottomless brunch really because it's too summery for a holiday or anything like that this is actually the perfect little summer outfit and you can so like mix and match all these pieces so these are the primark flip-flops they are so nice so guys i i need to go back and get the blue right now it's such a mistake me not getting the blue version of these as well because these are my new favorite pajamas they are literally brandy dupes they fit exactly like my brandy ones I was like, on the hanger, they weren't giving this. They were giving something, but not this. I'm so gutted. So they're definitely going to be sold out now. I'm so gutted I didn't get the blue ones, because, like, as well as these, because they are so adorable. These, my brownie pyjamas, and then the I got some fruit pyjamas from Primark the other day as well. They're all my current favourite pyjamas. It's down to Primark, like, now, because you all need these pyjamas. not going to lie, even though I didn't get loads, this is probably one of the most successful shopping hauls I've done. Can you tell by my mood? I'm, like, gassed. I'm, like, new sleigh clothes. And I'm actually kind of proud of myself. I don't know how much I actually managed to vlog my camera today, but I'm actually really proud of myself for vlogging because I was obviously in public on my own, and I usually hate vlogging, like, on my own, like, shopping, and it was so busy, and I'm actually so... I'm proud of myself because I really didn't think I was going to be able to vlog. Like this morning before I left, I was like so umming and ahhing whether to do this video or not. Because I was like, am I going to be able to vlog? I just fucking done it. I mean, I don't know how much I got, but hopefully, hopefully you guys enjoyed. I'm sure what my next video is going to be because I've got a really hectic week. I'm going to Marbella at the weekend. So I think I'm going to vlog Marbella. So the next video you guys see will be my Marbella vlog. Yeah, thank you so much for watching. Love you all and I will see you all in my next video.